Hello there again. Oh, I see my cat sitting in the back there. She wants to be in this video. Well, I was thinking about what I was going to talk about. And I tell you what, I am really working on enjoying life one day at a time. But, you know, you have those days. And today I found out I had made some mistakes. I'm not perfect. I do the best I can. But my brother called me this morning and he said, did you know you quoted wrong yesterday? I said, what? He said, that was the Vietnam and Korean time that your husband was in. I said, oh darn. So I researched it and he's right. Asians are Asians to me, but anyhow, it has been 69 years ago, maybe a little better. So please overlook me. But anyway, then what happens? Last night when I, I have another cat, he's a big tomcat, beautiful cat that we rescued and he is a real story. But let me tell you, this is bad bra day. My bra is killing me. Just, do any of you girls ever have a day that you put on a bra and it just, it's, you don't want to say bad words. So I'm not going to say bad words, but it is rough. And I'm going to go have to change this thing pretty soon because I'm in pain. Oh, Lord, help me, which he does. So I, I have another one, more than one, that I can put on. <laughs> but then that was not the end of it. And my cat has still not come home. He disappeared. Like he, he goes in and out all the time ever since we rescued him. And he always, I mean, you know, he always comes right back home. But anyway, I got to go home and change this bra before I go crazy. I'm going to continue to make this. I'm going to do good. But my brother Dan called me. And now he's 12 years younger than I am. And it reminded me of the time that I cornered my mother. You know, I'm the oldest of nine kids. Too many, too many. So when I was 12 years old and he was born, I cornered my mother in the kitchen and I, nobody around. I said, Mom, you've got enough kids. Isn't this enough? Is there anything? I'm 12 years old. Is there anything that's bound to be something that can stop this? Can't you and Daddy do something to stop this? She said, <laughs> we could, but your Daddy likes babies. And he did. They had two more after that. That's how I had seven brothers. So it was more changing diapers for me, which I do not enjoy. When I got married, my mom gave me an iron skillet and said, here you are. And I didn't know how to cook because I had always worked in the fields, you know, chopping corn, chopping tobacco, hanging them in the barn, and then we stripped tobacco. I know how to do all that. I know how to do that. I don't want to do it anymore. I'm a city girl. I like Walmart <laughs> and Myers <laughs> and all these. I like to go to the flea markets and yard sales. I just love yard sales. So, and my mind was going around, you know, like it does, like a butterfly, thinking all the time. And God is good. And he gives me some good times, but another little mistake I made, which was <laughs> kind of funny. You just have to look at what happened. But yesterday when I put this on, I said, uh, Julie uh, was wanting to use her friend's smartphone so she could watch YouTube. So she borrows her friends, and her friends came back to town, and she's walking around yesterday looking at it, and I said it was Julie. So today, she said, and I went to the Y, she said, hi there, my name is Judy. I said, oh dear, I thought it was Julie. She said, well, you got Janie's name right, but you got mine, I'm, I'm Judy. I said, forgive me, Judy. I'm, whoops, there's that cat's tail. <laughs> Anyhow, <laughs> so this morning I went, and and she had been Janie's back. She had borrowed her phone, and we were walking, and she come walking up with me, and I was walking around and around. It just you feel like a horse that you're going to make. You know, we had a my grandpa had a mule or a horse one that we would make uh, molasses every year, and that horse had to go round and around and grind that juice out of that cane so that they would have a big pot and then they would make uh, molasses and I always felt sorry for that horse 
But now I sometimes wonder if I ain't just like that walking around and around there at the Y. It's just a big circle. Got two lanes, one for runners and one for walkers. And when them runners get in it, how do you like this? This really stops this, don't it? You just can't see where I'm 90. I don't look no more than 70, do I? <laughs> Maybe 65. Well, anyway, you know how vain I am. <laughs> That's life. I just enjoy life that anyway. So anyhow, I'm walking this morning, me and number three. He goes, I go with him. And uh, he does the driving. But I can drive. I got, I got a car. I enjoy my car. Fact is, I got two cars. I got one in the garage and one out. I'm a blessed woman. I drive, I can rest one if one's not running. I run the other one when I run out of gas. Let me fix this. There I go. Anyway, so I'm walking, taking my time. I can't walk that fast. And here comes Judy. And you know what she has in her face? She's got Janie's smartphone watching me on YouTube. I said, what are you doing? She said, well, I missed the two last ones and I'm catching up as I walk. <laughs> Isn't life hilarious? I can't believe it, but it was fun. So I walked with her and then I got around there and I, and Janie was riding one of those things that like a bicycle. And I said, I got to talk I had to get away from listening to me. After all, I had done listen to it a few times, you know. <laughs> I don't do bad, do I, sometimes? But this is so sad about my big tomcat not coming back. I put it on neighbors. I hope he didn't get run over or something. But you know what I think? He's so friendly and outgoing. And it was 24 degrees last night. And I think somebody let that sucker in the house. So he wouldn't get cold. And I believe he will show up yet. And I put it on neighbors that he was missing. So I'm just trusting the Lord that he's either got a new home or he'll be back. In the meantime, I have Old Faithful here. She's right here beside me, keeping me company every morning when I do my YouTube. And I'm just having fun with this. Oh, did you like my pink? Now, what color should I wear tomorrow? That don't look too bad, does it? How about blue? Yellow? I don't know. <laughs> There's that tail again. So, Denny, I'm sorry. That's my brother. But I'm so glad you straightened me out, young man. I can call him young man because he's 12 years younger. Now, how old does that make him? I don't know. I never was good at math. Y'all figure it out. Talk to you later. <laughs> it's been a blessed day anyway. We look on the bright side, and this bra is killing me. I'll tell you the truth. You know... They got bigger, my jugs, after I got older. And you know when you get out of the shower and you flop them up and down and you're kind of wet, you know they slap when they hit. I told one girl that and they laughed because they said there's does the same thing. Oh my, I hope my number three don't get perturbed with me for saying something like that. But you know, y'all are all grown ups mainly. I don't do this for little kids, but I love y'all. God is good, and I trust the Lord, and I don't think he'll care if I told a little bit about my jugs. I didn't do what Dolly Parton did. You know what she did. Mine are for real. <laughs> They're what God gave me, and I thank him for what, everything he's given me. I better hush. This is getting up to nine minutes. i got to save some ideas. i got so many ideas that I would like to tell you about, but I just had to jump on this one today about... Everything that's going on, there's always something going on, isn't there? God bless you all. I love you, and thanks for looking. You know what? Just go ahead and subscribe. I might get rich one of these days. Then I'd have gas for my two cars. Talk to you later. <laughs> well, have a wonderful day. God bless all of you. May he direct your path in the way you should go that would be pleasing to him is my prayer.